Hello, it is Mary Ann Milka, and in this video, I am going to show you how to make a dip. That's pretty good. The recipe that I saw, it's called uh, Dunkaroo Dip, which to me, it didn't taste like Dunkaroo. So, before I get started, like, comment, subscribe. Turn on your notifications to let you know whenever I post another video. So, first, I'll tell you what you need. Get a second bowl. This dip I am making in the Cool Whip container. The second bowl is so you can pull some of the Cool Whip out and put it in to here. I, you can use plain Cool Whip. I use extra creamy Cool Whip because for me, it tastes a little bit better than the plain Cool Whip. Vanilla pudding. You need two things of vanilla pudding. And the last thing is, I believe you can make it with any kind of cake mix, but the kind they use, sell you to use is the Funfetti kind that has the sprinkles in it. This is all you need. And this could be just a snack that you eat. A dessert. If you're having a party, you could use it. Or at Christmas time, use a green, green, um, the Christmas funfetti. The reason I'm using the Valentine's Day funfetti is this is what I have. It doesn't matter the ratio that you put it in. After I make this, I might put a little bit more back in this container. It, you can make this in a big bowl and then... And then put it back in the container or use a different container to put it in. So if you're making this for a party or something, you would have to use, make it the night before. Because if you try this the day of, it's going to taste gritty and... It don't taste as good. And you're going to be like, why did Mary have me make this? So the reason I'm not measuring it is you don't want it to taste gritty like I said. So I am just sprinkling it in here. How much I think I want. And then all you do is stir it.
the only reason, the big reason I am putting half and half is this does grow when it sits in the refrigerator. And that's a learning curve that I had when I first made it. I think I just put enough in there. As you can hear, Mocha is barking at something outside. He's barking at UPS. With it in this bowl, you can see it after I'm done. So what you serve it with is, you could do uh, animal crackers to serve it with, or my favorite thing to eat this with is uh, graham crackers, the graham cracker sticks. But you could serve it with apples, pretty much anything. I was going to make it last night, but I got too tired, so I'm kind of glad I'm making it now. So, that's what it looks like. And like I said, um, when it sits, it does expand. It does have the perfect amount of cake in it. So like I said, I put it in the tub with the cool whip container and I use a second second container and that way that it won't expand and lift the lid off of it. So if you test this out, tell me if you like it or not. The cake mix, like I said, if you are putting this in a big bowl, I would just sprinkle enough to know that it is put in there. You don't want it thin. You want it a little bit thick where it's I would try it because if it tastes too gritty you've put too much um, cake mix in but I just did that the perfect amount it tastes fine right now I'm gonna let mine uh, chill in the refrigerator like I said best thing to do if you're gonna do this for a party or a Christmas get-together make it the night before so it's chilled and it sits it's sitting together 
this is one of the snacks I have been eating with losing weight. Two tablespoons of the Cool Whip is only 30 calories. And then So, this is one of the things I have been eating. I do have another really good uh, dip that I like making. And it's really not a dip. It's a Italian seasoning and cream cheese thing that's really good that I do eat. I'm going to make some more. But it, right now, I'm kind of like off on it I don't want it but I do want it type thing so if you make this let me know if you've liked it I will try to put the recipe in the description so you know the recipe so like, comment, subscribe, turn on your notifications, let you know whenever I post another video. With that being said, I hope you have a wonderful day or night whenever you watch this. Bye.